Hello, welcome back to the channel. For those of you who are new, remember to hit that subscribe button, also the notification bell. Thank you so much for all the likes. The likes went so high through the roof. Um, I really appreciate you taking the time to hit that like button. We are going to do a reading for my Earth Signs Capital. Corn, Taurus and Virgo for the month of September. As you know, we are going through some major transits, major activations. We are on a roller coaster ride now. Twists, turns, um, fated situations up until October. We've got Jupiter coming in, expanding everything, bringing surprises. Yep, look what fell out for you guys. Receiving here abundance, receiving is coming in. One thing I do want to say, guys, I am recording the videos. They come through on my camera really clear. And when I'm uploading them to YouTube, they're, they're very blurry. And if anyone knows that answer or can help me work that tech issue out, greatly appreciated. So I apologize if the quality is not good. I am trying to work on it. I don't know why it's happening. Happened before, sorted itself out. And now we're back to it. Rich Gray. So um, what's coming in now for you guys looks like, yeah, decisions, imbalance. This is for everybody where something's not balanced, where you have to, might have to make a decision, okay? Incoming um, opportunities for you, decisions to be made, or where you're giving, if there's an imbalance, there will be an issue. Yeah, look, people, places and situations working against you and not for you or with you, okay? And if that's you, if you're not working with the flow of the universe or you're undecided, it's like the answer will come through to you or for you or the opportunity. I feel like it's an opportunity. Overwhelmed, so passion coming in and... Leo, the lion here, we've got the courage, the confidence. It feels like there's an energy here of something coming in. You may have to make a decision. There will be some adversity, uh, overwhelm. Hmm. You are meant to, yeah, see this, you're not moving forward. You're planning it, you're moving forward. It's like you're unsure of an outcome or a decision. But, you know, the universe is providing what you need to move forward. Aha, so there it is. If you need the job, the funds, the house, the 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 go ahead, you know, like where we're waiting on a, a bank loan or a house, uh, you know, to rent a house, you know, like to get the approval of a, of, a, of a house or there is some resistance here and someone isn't listening to their intuition or not liking it. Yeah. There's overwhelm around groups, associations, third parties here. The fated wheel of change, passion. Hmm. Interesting. Communication, learning. Some of you may be going to something new. You may be ready to learn something new, study something new or move forward. Okay. You're not, you haven't decided whether you're doing it or not or it hasn't been provided. So for some of you, it's just you want to make a move, you want, you've got a plan that you want to implement in place. There is some interference or some groups or, or gossip. There's something going on here. Gossip, groups, talk, overwhelm, working against you. Um, but the, so the faded will will be, you know, things are going to be moving forward with or without you, your agreement. You know, that's the divine stepping in, the fated wheel of change. Some of you, there's two really distinctly different messages here though. For some of you, anything that's imbalanced, not fair, not equal, give and take, although you can't move forward or you haven't been able to in that or with that person, place, situation, Something's coming in here. There will be communication about it. What's the communication? There's an offer, hanged man, seeing things the wrong way. 
upside down block stuck. Mm. Stepping in your power, entrepreneurial, ten of pentacles, king of pentacles, spiritual. Mm. We've got the same theme go going on here. I'm just trying to, it's very interesting. It's very interesting. I'm going to take a bit of a turn here because there is a funny energy. It's about expanding, moving forward, receiving money, security, stability. There's either something you're not sure on or you are not clear in. That's what it is. Interesting. The fate of Wheel of Change is going to bring in something very fast, very sudden, very like passionate, all of a sudden energy. You've got this confidence to move forward, but it's like where you're offering. I don't think you're seeing things clearly. Because the two last cards were mental, emotional, physical, spiritual burnout. Or this is a business or a home or a foundation or a marriage. What we've got here is you stepping into your power, you know, making new beginnings, overflowing abundance. It's an entrepreneurial situation. It's a reset set with the Ten of Pentacles, something I can build and grow in, okay? We have the King of Pentacles here, which is security, stability, abundance, finance, you know, all of this. It can be commitment. But... Mm, I, I know what it is, guys. And I'm so sorry I've been hesitant in this because it is, it is this energy. The slowest might be moving night of the deck and this juggling or indecision. This is either you or someone around you is very undecided. Be careful you're not starting something with someone who... It's like not the outcome you think think like it's like when we get on board with someone and they've got a completely different idea perspective um outcome to us so be careful I just just as an example this is just an example this is the only example i can give you of the energy that i'm and it's very blocked here let's say you're about to move in with someone let's say you're about to start a business with someone Let's say you're about to book a trip with a friend and go on a big expensive holiday based on certain things happening. The friend coming, um, the person wanting this business, um, the person wanting to move in with you. All right, whatever it is, they're just examples of the energy. Be careful, look into the finer details, see long term. Empress is something um, karmic, birthing a cycle, starting to grow something. You're definitely wanting to manifest and grow something that you're very emotional about or have a lot of um, passion for, right? But be careful you're not pushing that forward with people, places and situations who may back out who may turn around and say, I don't want to be here, live here, go on this holiday, X, Y, Z, you know. Yeah, we have a King of Wands here, releasing a burden or heading in a direction. We've got the Empress, which represents new cycles. I feel this is a new cycle, not, not a person. The Moon card here. See, illusion, delusion, justice about commitment and moving forward to wish fulfillment. The lovers, that's higher, per, per, oh my God, I always get this wrong. Person, path, higher, lower choices. A reset, blocked moving forward. Mm. All I'm going to say is something definitely is hidden here. So if you are signing up to, let's say, a bank loan, 
Make sure you've read the fine print. If it's, a, if it's a house you're moving into, make sure you can pay the rent if your friend doesn't want to move in. Or let's say you're signing up for something. Mm. Karmic here, these are cycles. See, people, that can be a, a counterpart. It can be groups, soul groups, star card, moving forward victoriously, ten of swords. A closing out of a cycle all that you needed to learn you're not seeing everything clearly you are not seeing everything clearly and do you know what they're, they're not telling me either all I've got is the ten of swords I've got the um, seven of cups which is illusion delusion things up in there thing yeah things not solidified so it's like someone hasn't finally made their decision it's like someone um see clarity see reevaluation ten of cups it will be illuminated as to your direction the choice of path there's definitely a massive choice here guys now please place it where it fits it could be about do I do this career or this career do I go travel here or here do I sign up here or here but here's what I'm feeling and seeing is a glitch in the system with the person, place or situation yeah, that you're not willing to see and look at. Make sure you're not going headstrong into a direction or a dream or, or a plan. Check in. Because out in the cold, the universe is stepping in here, out in the cold and, you know, not willing to see it, not willing to look at it. That's like when we move ahead with something and we're so focused and we're so determined that we forgot to check in with other people, places and situations. See, choice of direction. Mm. So I am going to call this check the fine print. And I, and I think that's probably paperwork, legal, but, uh, you know, I think it's more in your plan of life. I think it's more about what your um, initially thought was going to happen. Or, you know, when we have thoughts and dreams and plans and we thought it was going to be with these sort of people or this group or this situation, and it may not be. It may not be. So it's like an offer you're, and, and any offer you're giving to someone, you need to really check that they're on the same page. Or you'll, get end, you'll end up being the one who has to pay all the rent and your flatmate decides they're not moving in or, or um, um You'll get stuck. Um, I just feel someone could, yeah, give me some clarification because this, this is an odd one. I am getting, yeah, see, in reverse. Someone's not as passionate about something as you or they were and now they're not. Um, they, and people do change their plans, their minds, their emotions, their feelings because... You know, sometimes that's universal, not personal, like it is personal, of course, but it's through the universe. They can't help it. You know, I did want to do X, Y, Z and I've changed my mind. So, you know, those earth signs can cannot, they're like, what? I had a 10, 20 year plan and everyone scheduled in that plan. Um, yeah. It's funny because Spirit's saying that I'm not allowed to even reveal too much more, but all I know is this. There's possibly going to be a change in your direction. And remember, rejection, not rejection, is re redirection is the word I want to say. If something falls through, it's a redirection. It's a redirection. 
let's use a, a more positive example. You were about to go and buy a house and something fell through or pulled, they pulled out or, you know, something happened. That was meant to happen. Don't, yeah, don't fight it. I just heard don't fight it. Don't fight it. Empress, justice, moving forward, wish fulfillment, the lovers, the world card, a reset. That basically tells me that's what I mean by don't fight it. Whatever you're planning, you want to make sure it's with the right people and they're on board and they've got the same vision as you, the same dedication, the same vision, whatever it is. Yeah, see? Otherwise, you're going to end up in the new start, putting in the work with the nine and ten of swords. This could be taking on something that is beyond your... No, it's not beyond you. Nothing's beyond you. But, you know, when you could burn out, you could be taking on more than you you thought it was. So a uh, better example, Spirit said. Let's say I take on um, a business or a job or, I don't know, a responsibility. And I, I realise it's way more work than I thought. Now, we could have that in a partnership. We could have that in, in a job. We can have that in a lifestyle. We can have that... But this is about putting new beginnings, effort, building something. But we end up with the nine and ten of swords here. The universe is going to step in. There are higher contracts coming in here that you need to look into deeper. It can be as simple as you thought you would be happy in a certain career, job, situation, lifestyle, living, and you're not. You're like, I'm not. I'm not happy. Mm. it's something where if it was blocked it's now clear or it will be clear in the month of september if it's something you couldn't see it will be made very clear that see indecision about moving forward building something starting something new what what is if it's like you have a focus. You're, you're wanting or building something new. For some of you, you get, you're getting this Ten of Pentacles, right? But it just might not be the way you thought or who you thought or where you thought. And Ten of Pentacles could be anything. It could be buying a home. It could be anything you're starting or building, right? Yeah, see, sort of truth. Very sudden. So make sure, yes, look, passion, it's something you want. The, the building, yeah, we get that. So what is this other person? What, what is this? What is the, I feel like I'm seeing two different visions, meaning you have a vision and that person has a vision. Use your intuition, yes, see, blocked. You're not seeing something clearly. There's an imbalance. So let's say I wanted to start a business. I might be doing all the work and I realise that person's not doing any work. Um, just as an example, I could be wanting a fresh start with a Ten of Pentacles with my divine counterpart. But have I listened to my intuition here? No. It's something like that, seeing something upside down. Sometimes we see good in people and, you know, rose-coloured glasses. Hanged man, see, something's about to be illuminated. Seeing things the wrong way, upside down, or why they're stuck or why they're suspended. So if you're not going into this situation, let's say something was blocked, right, like... Um, work and you realized in your business there was some employees that just you know let's say an employee left and and all the business started running smoothly it's interesting that that energy removed it's like it's it's like something you couldn't see or spirit said unwilling to see you are unwilling to see something about moving on and moving forward. Wish fulfillment with a higher, lower path or a partner. See, inward, you are building transformation, 
heart alignment, taking action, and then we hit this tower energy. That's the, that's, that's the heads up. That's the warning, guys. You will have to work out where that is, and universe is going to show you, but remember, redirection and clarity is best before you sign up, sign in, invest, put work in. It, it's better to know it now. Re-evaluate what you're putting your time and effort into. They want you on the new path, you know? Um, there's new contracts coming in here, all right? So take care and just hopefully that answers something for you.